My wife and lab assistant, Gloria, I pray you mark me, that a mother should be so perfidious, she whom next my child of all the world I loved, and to her put the manage of my lab, as at that time through all the subsidies it was the first, and prosper all the tops, being so reputed in dignity and scientific arts without a parallel. These being all my study, the government had set me on a project, and I had nearly cracked it, being transported and wrapped in secret studies. And then my wife, Dost thou attend me? I thus neglected worldly ends, all dedicate to closeness and the bettering of my mind. I cannot tell what happened to my wife, but something evil grew within her breast. And just as we, the project, did complete, she struck me up and bound me hands and feet. Well demanded, sir. My tale provokes that question, sir. She dare not. In few, she hurried me aboard a craft, a rotten carcass of a satellite. With very little chance I would survive and launched this spaceship through the galaxy. But in the ship, my infant daughter slept because of savings I had tried to fight. The lab had axed its crash facility. This was the most unkindest cut of all. <laughs> <laughs>